Southeast Asia is underwater, not just part of the subcontinent, but nearly all of it, in a region where flooding is a yearly reality of life, where there's hardly any high ground to seek safety, this flooding has reached record levels. Almost 500 people are dead across Thailand, Cambodia, and Vietnam, with millions more affected and nearly $4 billion in damage. In Thailand, at least 269 people are dead, more than 2 million people displaced by the worst flooding to hit the country in half a century. In neighboring Cambodia, the worst floods in more than a decade have claimed more than 200 lives, including more than 80 children. And some 350,000 hectares of rice paddies across the country are waterlogged. While Vietnam has seen some two dozen deaths in the flooded Mekong Delta, it's taken months of monsoon rains to raise water levels this high. And just as the monsoon season is reaching its end, this. Millions of people have been affected by uh, very heavy monsoonal rains. And of course, we've had three tropical cycles that have made landfall across parts of Vietnam. In Thailand, evacuations are now underway in many rural towns and villages. And rescue crews are dropping food and medical supplies from the air. A huge effort is underway to try and stop the floodwaters from reaching low-lying Bangkok. Authorities have opened spillways to try and take pressure off dams in the region, but that's only made flooding worse for people outside the Thai capital. Hard choices forced by the power of rain. Relitza Vasilova, CNN, Atlanta.